Today I will be guiding you to a RAM upgrade. It's not difficult if you know how to do it, but for someone who has never done it before, it might be a daunting task. In the first episode where I introduced you to the Project Tiny Home Lab, I showed you the Lenovo M900 Think Sandros. Because I wanted to get the maximum performance out of these, I decided to do a RAM upgrade before continuing on with the project. That's why I got some extra DDR4 RAM sticks of 16GB each. The M900 can support a speed of maximum 2133MHz. Since this is getting harder to find, I settled down with 2666MHz RAM. The BIOS will automatically throttle down the higher spec RAM to this value. So what do we need to do this? Just a screwdriver to loosen any screws that block our entry and the PC that you want to upgrade. Simply loosen the single screw on the back side of the unit. Now we can slide forward the top casing to open the unit. You can already see the existing RAM peeking through the SATA drive bay. To remove this we again need to loosen one screw. If it's too tight to loosen by hand you can use your screwdriver again. Removing it is a case of simply sliding it to the front, but be careful since there's an antenna attached to it. It's up to you if you decide to keep it attached or to remove it. Now we can have a look at our memory. On both sides there is a clip holding it in place. If you move those slightly outwards it will release the memory. Now we can install the new memory by placing it in with a slight angle. Do not force it in, it should go smoothly. You should not see any of the gold contact pins. With some light pressure, you can click the memory in place. And that's basically it. Now it's just a matter of reassembling everything and to test it out. When you are reattaching the drive bay holder, make sure it's clipped into all the connection posts, otherwise it will rattle and it might damage something. Also double check any of the antenna connections. That's it for this video, I hope you find it useful. Please like and subscribe and I will see you all next time. Bye.